Hi, my name is Leanne Ostergaard, and I am one of the team members of Scrapbook Expo. I'm here today to share a tip with you, brought to you by Scrapbook Expo. The fun tip that I have for you today is tissue paper photo. As you can see, this darling little fo photo was put on a canvas. And I want to show you how simple and how fun to have a home decor in your home that you can place on the wall or on a tabletop, on maybe the entry into your home. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to need any size of canvas. If you have a 12 by 12 printer, you can go as far as 12 by 12. Or if it's an 8 and a half by 11, you want to make sure that your photos are no bigger than that. Next, you're going to need just some Mod Podge, a simple brush, and then double-sided tape, piece of tissue paper, and just regular paper from your printer. You're going to place your printer paper on top of your tissue and you want to make sure that you have about an inch on each side. Because what you're going to do is you're going to bend it over, take your double-sided tape and you're just going to tape it down. And you want to make sure that it's nice and secure so that you don't have the wrinkles. Now if you do have tissue paper that's a little bit wrinkled and you want to get rid of that effect, all you have to do is take a real low iron and you can iron over the top of that and it'll take out those wrinkles of your tissue paper. Then you're just going to fold that over on both ends. And it doesn't even hurt to put one in the middle just to give it a little bit more secure. Once you get that done, then you're going to take your scissors and you're just going to trim the sides so that now you have an 8.5 by 11 sheet of paper. You're going to place that into your printer and as the printer feeds off, it will print your tissue paper so it looks like this. Now to show you on the back, again, I just taped it down, ran it through the printer, and this is what it, it looks like. Then you're going to take your canvas and your Mod Podge and you're just going to take your Mod Podge and lightly go over your canvas. And you don't want it to get dry, just a real thin layer. Then you're going to take your photo and place it on the top. With a rubbing motion of, with your finger, just go in circles until you get all of the wrinkles out of your photo. Then once you do that, it's all set and done. You set it to the side, let it dry, add your um, embellishments, and you have a darling little photo that you can set out or put on your wall. That's your tip of the day, again, from Scrapbook Expo.